I want a boyfriend so bad. I want him to hold my hand and take Whatever you do, runners, right now, just don't think about the 135 miles of scorching highway in front of you. I never want to feel it again. I never want to feel it again. It's the worst pain I can ever even, I can't even describe the pain of that last 30 miles to anybody. No one, it's very hard. But what it did was it showed me what is possible. And I ended up finding a way to get through that 30 miles. And when I got done with that race, I'm laying there in the worst pain of my entire life. I'm shaking, I'm jacked up. I look at my ex-wife and I literally say, I'm gonna shit on myself right now. So I sit there and I'm, I'm shitting up my back and I'm peeing blood down my leg. And I have 30 miles to go. Because when you get to 70 miles of a race and you felt the way I did, to me it was humanly impossible to even think about going 30 more miles in that shape. And once you do it, what, what came over me when that shower hit me, and, and the reality hit that, I just went 101 miles. And that last 31 miles was something that I can't even describe to people. All I could think about was, oh man, I've really been underachieving my entire life. I can't believe what I've just done.